right, first of all, I'd like to thank the fans and the viewers out there. Thanks for watching. And uh, today I'm going to show you how I flame cut my nut. Let's get started. Alright, this is called the coconut. A coconut is a piece of two inch tubing, wrap and rake, with an 18 inch blow tube, and the blow tube stays attached to the coconut after it's blown out. Okay, first, first get this thing hot. Once it gets hot, put your silver on, grab your color, put the color in front and the tube in back, heat the color up, touch it on, start pulling it off. Feed the color into the flame. Okay. As soon as you trail it on, take your paddle, paddle down the high spots. If you have any thin spots that you don't like, you can always go back, trail on a little more. I missed a couple spots there. Okay. Then grab your four mil. For the coconut, I like to do four. No, I like to do eight ranks. So eight ranks. When you rank, it's just something you have to get used to. Keep the heat out in front of where you're headed. Try to rank back and forth. When you first start out, you can go one direction. Okay, heat the whole thing up a little bit, heat up the tip of the point here, take off this uneven stuff, flame cut all this off of here. Alright, take your punch. Well, actually, we're not ready for the punty yet. First, you want to smooth out the color and the rake here on the end. Because you won't be able to smooth this out while it's on the punty because it'll get too out of control. So, do it now. Don't forget to always keep heating this back side up or it's going to crack on you. Attach your punty. Okay, 
okay? Heat up the shoulder closest to the blow tube. Get that area worked in. Okay, once it's worked in, get this other side. Now the whole thing is going to want to get out of control on you. Okay, that looks pretty good. Blow it out. You're going to make this a 5 inch coconut. So I have my gauge already made. I'll let this cool some. Okay, this whole time I've been slowly increasing the pressure inside the ball, or the, the coconut. As it cools, I increase the pressure. And just before it cools, and it's still a little bit pliable, is when it gets round. Trust me on this one. Okay, that's about five inches. All right, you'll have a little bit of a uh, nipple here on the end. You're not going to want that. Take that off. Don't take too much off or it'll get too thin on the bottom. Sometimes gravity alone will be enough to round out the bottom. You want to leave it round on the bottom, just like a coconut. Okay. Turn the flame down. What I like to do is roll it on my finger here, and then I'll get the high spot. Okay, heat up a little spot. Put your stamp on it. Go next to that spot. Heat up a spot about the size of a nickel. Open a hole, take your hexagonal reamer, now what's important right here is that you look at the angle of your hexagonal reamer when you ream it out the hole, otherwise it's going to be crooked and the female stem, the female down stem is going to come out crooked, people are going to laugh at it, so take the time to look at it. Make sure the hole is square. You know what I mean. Not a square hole, but. Alright, that's it. I just cut my nut. My coconut, that is. Alright, thanks again. See you next time. And we'll burn and learn.